Now uh, let's go back uh, to the uh, the back of the house and we can do that by moving over and swinging around and we get over to the back of our house and look at putting in a, uh, a patio here. So uh, why don't we uh, go over back over to, uh, to plan view again and we're going to have to put in our, uh, our patio right here. Again we use our patio tool and we can begin to just draw and we can put in 45s of course and we can build our complete patio like so again the default products uh, come in with the uh, quartz stone and the rich cliff you can take a look at that in in perspective and we can leave the uh, the pavers and uh, why don't we uh, put a nice winding walkway in uh, from the front to the back. Now in order to do that I would go back to plan view and I would make my way over to uh, the landscape tool use path and then to make this as precise as possible you can zoom in and automatically over here you can see we're at four feet wide and we'll keep that as a four foot wide walk and we want to have it rounded and here we have the option of going straight or rounded so we're going to leave it at rounded and we're going to turn our snap off because with curves that's always a bit of a nuisance so here we go just start making our way over to the backyard We'll join up with that side door uh, a little while later. And if you have to, push down on the wheel in the center of your mouse and the hand will come up and you'll be able to slide over the picture. And once we get to there, we're ready to uh, right click and finish her up. Now, see we have a winding walkway of Copthorne with a double row of quartz stone around uh, H. Now if you notice here if there's some issues with uh, the points we can uh, highlight them, we can delete points if we want, we can highlight points and straighten the lines out, we can delete some more here and highlight again and push the straighten button here and then we can drag that up make that all nice and and even. We can actually widen this out if we wanted to uh, flare things out. We can flare it out on both sides and then we have a nice flare to the end of the uh, the walkway. Now all these points here are adjustable so that if you want to smooth out the, some of the walkway you can do that here and then just click edit points before you go on to do anything else. 